and then side to side. So back to front, center, side to side. Okay. And then just to make sure that it's on there good, we add a little bit more heat. And same with the kiddo pusher. Back to forward and do the sides. All jamboree nail wraps are used heat and pressure. It's all with heat and pressure, okay? Now if you notice on my wraps you're gonna see that there's a little bit of line at the back, a little bit of line at the sides. You always want to leave just a little bit showing, just a sliver. And if you notice, you can't even notice that there's a sliver actually missing, okay? That looks good, okay? So then you let it cool off for a minute. Now you can go on and do another nail while that's cooling, or you can wait. And then what you're gonna do is you're going to file downwards and get the excess of that nail off, okay? So I always go the full length, because if you go the full length, it makes for less work. Okay, and voila, there you go. Your nail wrap is done for your thumb. I like to heat it up just a little bit more and make sure I got that tip all pushed down. Make sure it's looking good. And there you go, there's your thumb. So stay tuned with me and we'll continue doing the rest of these nail wraps. Okay. You can do it like this too if you want. Again, this is just how I do it. Everyone will do it diff a little bit differently. You do what works for you. This is just what works for me. So then, one, two, three, four, five, back.